to scam you this time. I'm fine. I don't mind hybrid, but I think they're gonna flip a lid. Otherwise, hmm. What to do? What to do? You could do druid at the start. That definitely clears into some prisoners. Yigi later. Got to get our greed. I think if you put this guy a couple of steps back, he's got a better chance of getting his chain lightning off, maybe. So that's where I'm thinking with that. Because he always seems to have like, oh, no, one more spell, the mana's almost full, and then he just dies. I can get two wisps with this, I'm certain of it. If I send a dino, I can do a prisoner for the level two. But of course, then we don't have a strong center level three, so... But that's the only way I can get a prisoner of, of level 2. Otherwise, Footman? Is Footman okay? I can't really remember building Footman very often and upgrading it. Or am I going to regret a Footman? He's got normal armor. Medium armor, which is bad. If he gets upgraded to heavy on his upgrade, it wouldn't be so bad. But I don't know what his upgrade upgrades into. Because I could get two prisoners. I bid you. you got a Yigi over here. Normally you want to send something, don't you? When you do the Yigi. Depends if you built Wiss. No, you didn't build Wiss. I'll send the dino out then. Elite Archer's good. Nightmare's fine, really. At least early enough. Druid pretty much just about doing it. So there's our 126 gold. Let's see, do a prisoner. He can go right in front, that's okay. Or two steps in front. Yeah, two steps. It looks to me like it's going to be Druid, Ascendant, Prisoner, and Yigi this game. Unless I want to re-roll, but not necessarily, because it doesn't seem too bad. I don't have that much DPS, though. I'll be lacking DPS later on. I'll have tankiness, though. Mm. Yeah, don't have much damage. Oh, they did a dino. Okay, we we'll just have to survive. I think I won't survive, though. The dino hasn't got his attacks off yet, so that's really good. Now it's happening. Yeah, there's no way I'm going to survive this, surely. There's no way. I can't imagine I could possibly survive this. Nah, you're not going to survive it, but... Doing okay, under the circumstances. It went worse for Soap. You guys will easily be able to pick that off. So you'll get a little bit of uh, cash for your troubles. Bit of feed. To be fair, it's really not that bad a result. Because we, me and Soap are kind of like the two tanky players. You guys get to build more carry units. I bid you. 80 gold exactly. I think I'm going to have to tinker with a footman then. See the Noble Warrior. Ah, oh, that's 80 gold. Yeah, it's going to have to be a footman. He's going to have to go behind. 
If I put him here, he'll just walk in front of the prisoner and get himself killed, like, immediately. Footman doesn't even really one-shot this level. So he's not super good. That definitely looks like another leak. Footman wasn't very great there, to be honest. I just didn't have much of a great option. Let's face it. Yeah, that's a little brutal. That's a wee bit brutal. Footman just unfortunately wasn't a great... There wasn't much I could do. Egg sack was the only other thing. Needed heavy armor or something, and then he wouldn't have sucked so much. But he's 55 to 59 damage, was like leaving the mobs on like one health. It's okay, it doesn't matter so much. It's evenish leak, leak so far. I got enough for another prisoner, so that's good enough. Then I can move on in life. Job's done. It's not too detrimental to me because the build I've got won't be too affected by it. If I was being greedier and wanted more damage, it would affect me more. But all I need to do is get an Ascendant at some point and start getting a Yigi. Or just upgrade the Prisoners first for level 10 and then go Yigis after that and I'll be okay. I bid you. Say the word. He still has medium armor when he's upgraded. He only goes to 60 to 66 damage. So you'd have to get the upgrade for him for level 3, I think. And then that's like still an investment in medium armor. He'll be good on level 7, though. He's got defend. And he's got... Yeah, I could just upgrade him now, to be honest. Because he'll be okay. I... I don't know the defender's really going to have any impact on the eagles, but probably, maybe, if they're ranged. I am prepared. I don't think any of this is too devastating. I've had leaks before where it's, it's felt a lot worse. The only downside is I can't upgrade him now, so... I'm kind of forced. What about double for him? Lean into the anti-level 7. <laughs> I'm almost tempted to do it, just so I can put another wisp down. Terrific! Alright, you maniac. <laughs> Alright, you maniac. I could just get the Null Warrior and then upgrade him. And then he can be like an anti-level 10 instead of having too many footmen and stuff like that. That way I won't feel so bad. We've got double tank on the fortified armor. Footman going down well quick though, actually. Knoll's down. Tanks are down. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. It's a rough game for me. Chain lightning! Oh, thank god. Look how much I leak there though. <laughs> That's a fucking lot, man. Oh boy. I'm trying to get some wisps in here, but it's not working out. <laughs> hmm. Did you leak as well, Woodstone? You got less value than me. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Everyone will say, ah, there's different attack types and different armor types, but some units are so strong compared to others. Okay. Oh, we're getting brutalized here. I'm not even feeling confident about the next level. And I'm kind of forced into a prisoner. I can't get the uh, footman. No, you can't re-roll. I mean, you could re-roll. Can't get Yigi, though. I'll have to sacrifice Yigi. See if I can find a rifleman or something. Research complete. 
There's a machine turret. Can't afford the foil. You can get a finger magic. My brothers. That's a given. Spitter of sick rhymes. Job's done. That'll do. I am prepared. Upgrade complete. This is a rough game, though. I've just got to survive, basically. This game has not gone well for me. I carried so hard last Legion TD, so I think it's fair that I don't have to carry so hard this time. Send. I'm going to have to send some greed shit, though. To make up for my follies. I got a bad feeling about this. Storm's coming, Annie. You better get home quick. Tactical leak. Thirty more value than Woodstone. Woodstone's got fucking seven two as well. Perfectly fair and balanced. Right. Well, it's time to get that fucking guard then. So I can devastate the next level. Oh, that's okay. I've been really good the last few Legion TDs. Watch them on my YouTube channel. Make sure to like the video. I've been I've been too good to be honest. So it's about time I I decided to have a bad game or so. What is your wish? So he's going to take seventy five percent of damage from piercing attacks. I assume that works against level 7, even though technically it's not ranged. I have King, yes, a little bit. Don't say Pearson. Footman's gonna have to save the day. I'm gonna get so destroyed. Going to be the biggest leak of your life. To be fair, Woodstone actually leaked as much as I did that time. So at least there's some justice. We got immolation, boys. We don't know they got immolation. At your call. They don't have immolation. That's good for us. Keep armoring up. This is going to take a long ass time. Immolation's going to save our bacon though. We might have outplayed them, boys. We might have actually outplayed them. Good job, team. Still got two lives left. GG, I played so bloody well. I nailed that. I told you, I said we had immolation, and we bloody won. So really well done, team. Good job. We did what we needed to do. The game is perfectly balanced. Mm. Mm. All right, now it's time for me to win very easily. I did the... Uh, the meme. I played well for the team, but not for myself. Now it's time to do well for myself. Uh, what about Mass Tridesman? This isn't really anything good for tanking. I wonder if that's just a straight up reroll, to be honest with you. Not even putting down a. Tri I can put down a Tridesman and reroll. I reckon that's a reroll, to be honest. Research complete. 
There it is. There it is! Time to play well, boys. Time to play well. Job's done. Might just keep that tribesman. It has begun. Job's done. Really should do free aqua spirits and sell the tribesman. Actually, screw it. Yeah, go greedy. Oh, the greed. I do like a little bit of greed. Yes. I do like a little bit of greed. I do like my greed. I like a bit of greed. Just a little bit of greed. I bid you. No one shall be the one. That'll do me, boys. That'll do. My elite archer is here. Plain elite archer style. I am prepared. No. I don't think it does. I think you need a little bit behind him. I'm almost going to send a dino as well. I think the hit thing with this is you either just keep pushing to go like seven, 2 or 7 3 pretty early, but guarantee leak on 10 and 8 and 7. Or I can try to sort of not push quite so hard and do better on those previous levels. Thing is, I don't really have anything that's that good against the other levels anyway. Like, Trollfighter comes in much better, level 10 onwards. Nightmare's not exactly ecstatic, neither is Minotaur. Bone Warriors. I want to see what the armor type of the upgraded one is. I think it's still medium. Job's done. Yeah, it's still medium, so that doesn't... Eh, that might come in handy at level 7 onwards. Hmm. Or just keep building war elementals. Maybe upgrade one into an Oceanus. Your skin and gold tips. Eh. Nah, can't be bothered leveling that up now. If I can get away with a double diner, I'm doing a double diner. I think I can, because I pushed so hard at the start. The ultimate reward. Not even a Blood Orc. I don't know, actually. Double Dino is kind of far away. They got like a Yigi, maybe. That's just good. So it's taking a bit longer to clear. Double Dino is a possibility, boys. Double Dino is... Oh my gosh, what's going on here? Someone's pushed their luck a bit too much. Double Dino is on its way. The kills have stopped. The double dino is set in motion. 14 income. It wasn't Stylo who leaked then. Chichoff. I am prepared. It has begun. We got Chichoffed. Oh, she ain't a s Out with it. And an aqua spirit. And there's all your gold. I'm not saying this level's going to go well for me anyway, because it ain't. But at least I put all my gold in so I can kill whatever the hell I can kill before I get taken over. I'm feeling kind of cute. Look at that 14 income. That is marvellous. That was a genius idea to do that, because now I can put down more to do better for the team. Yeah, I think the reason why I've been losing the Legion TD games is because Chichoff was on my team, to be honest. Look at that Oceanus. He is pumping. Big pumping Oceanus. Pumping all over. God damn! That's some domination right there. 
Now that is what I call a professional Legion TD player. Look at that. See? It's amazing, isn't it? You think I'm bad because you've watched the first part, but that's not the case. Actually, I deliberately did that so that we could win as a team. Now, I'm taking this home and doing this for myself. Could you tank, please? I'm down. Okay, enjoy your orc grunt kill there. All I need is to get another... Oh. King has to do something. Tempted to do a regen, to be honest. One gold. Mm. More aqua spirits. Bone warrior. Into skeletal marge. Or more wisps. Maybe more wisps. Enlighten me. More greed is required. Done. You're going for the item I linked on your druid. What item? Oh no, 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 no. I don't care about the druid. The druid is just there to make me money. Get level 25, do the quests, get the two gold for each quest, basically. I'm not sure I'm going to do anything with the druid. I mean, the crowd pummeler is one of the reasons why I wouldn't want to play. Uh, I wouldn't want that item. Because that item sucks. It's annoying. It has so many charges, so you have to keep getting it over and over. It's a real pain. I don't like that item at all. Hmm. If they're changing it, then it won't be so bad. You don't have charges anymore. Oh, God. But you have to sort of use it, which is kind of clunky. Which is, again, I don't like. There's some sort of weird min-max thing to do with it. And... I could... Oh, I couldn't afford it. I am prepared. Level 5. Upgrade complete. My brothers. I'm not completely convinced. Three minute cooldown. That's not so bad. There's something about it, though, I kind of don't like. It's this sort of like, it's this extra hotkey you've got to have attached to it. It's been manipulated. It's okay in like Warcraft 3 custom games or something, but I don't know if I like it as part of my rotation in World of Warcraft. I thought about the Skeletal Mages, but I don't know if it's really worth it for Water Elementals, even Oceanuses. Oh, I have farmed for it before. That's why I don't want it. <laughs> I've been there and I've done that. Back in 2019, classic. Wow, you guys leaked. Holy shit. I've not got enough to clear all that. I've barely got enough to kill any of that. So I can't even get too much gold as a reward for you guys all leaking. Hmm. See if I can pick one of them off. Yeah, there we go. Four gold. Am I going to have to upgrade the king here? Jeez. I don't know whether I actually do need to upgrade the king. I think he's going to be okay without upgrades. Yeah, he's going to be okay. It actually auto turns off his ability. 
Right. Right. Uh, you could just get mass nightmares. I could even get the knight of the captain. You're the captain. To be honest, I'm kind of screwed. Unless I start putting nightmares down or something, I think I'm screwed. I'm not going to kill, though. That's the thing. Nothing I have is going to kill. Like, I'm trying to... I can do this. I've already been greedy. I've got some gold. I've got some rewards. I reckon I can still try to take down level 10. I won't be able to, but... I can try. I can bloody well try. Please steal a wrath and make pets even... They keep nerfing pets, though. Hunter keeps getting nerfed. Yeah, I kind of forgot about my hunter. In fact, I should probably just hand in the quest on the hunter, actually, if he's got any. Just for the experience, just for the gold. Can always level them up much later on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do your furb and your hermit and then the dinos. Yeah, I could actually hand the hunter's quest in now just to get the gold. Even though I've always wanted to hand that, hand that stuff in to give me an easier time afterwards. Come on! Come on! Come on! Too late. Now you give it to me. Bugger. Hmm. Right. Needs more water elementals. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's that's the thing, though. I don't have an interest in the Hunter now until, like, potentially level 60. It's still, it's Mage. Like, Mage wasn't supposed to get played, because I played Mage so much before, but I like Mage so goddamn much, I still keep going back to Mage. Paladin's the only other Kalos that stands a chance, if it can AoE as good as Mage, which I don't think it will be able to at level 60. Season of Discovery, unless you get some insane ability to mitigate damage, and then pile all the mobs like he normally does. I'm gonna go down, boys. I'm gonna go down. Jeff, just not an easy level, is it? No matter what. Doesn't matter how well you're done. It does not matter. This level is. You cannot do this level with water elementals. Yeah, they did send a lot. They sent a hell of a lot. We got 55 alive on our side. What's going on, boys? He could actually be dead here, to be honest. And by could, I mean pretty much now, right? Just when I was so good and greedy. Don't get to keep my greed. Gonna be doing this for a while by the looks of it. Four males, only got 300 left on it. Keep going, four male. Keep going. I mean, he's kind of tanking it. I'll have to wait and activate four male again when he gets to about. 50 mana or 40 mana. I don't think we're dead necessarily. Well, to be honest. I have to activate it now, really. 50 mana. Just to finish off those last few seconds. Oh, look at that. It's already gone. Yeah, we're dead. This is crazy. <laughs> I had the highest income. Damn it. I don't know. Too many people on this team screwed up. Oh man. I don't know if I'm gonna be get, able to get that greedy again. Unless I get like um archer. Alright, this is it. This is my turn. 
Oh, that looks better. Could do a. I might have to do a yig. I always want to push my greed, but I might have to do a yig, boys. And then I could do rangers behind it, and I'm kind of covered. I might have to yig. I would do a knight, but. Uh, I'm going to be greedy. I'm going to get the knight. And then I'm going to have to find some way to take him up to Cavalier for turn three. Job's done. going to get 137 gold, 147 gold, 111 gold. I need to skip this wisp, I think, and build n almost next to nothing. And still probably not even be able to afford Cavalier by level three. That's going to be tough. How am I going to do that? Like one ranger... 40 gold. Yeah. 119, 147. If you do like two rangers, maybe you can clear level two. Probably not for usually. Or but any leaks you get, you can... I really want to get the cavalier. And get cavalier and rangers. That'd be really cool. I'd love to do that. Because I've done yig before. I want to get Cavalier. It's just not easy to set up. But he should be good for the first couple of levels. Heavy armor, fast attack. More than enough damage to one shot. Shouldn't be too much of a problem there. And then I can steal the kills when other people leak later on. Yeah, see? Level 2 looks a bit promising, because that was not too bad. So, he's got pretty much half his health. If they do send a dino, though, that could be nasty. So, if you do one more archer, that puts you to 190 gold, let's say, for example. 190 gold, plus 147 gold. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. That's enough for a cavalier, even with some leaks. So, I think you do the archer. One should be the wise. That's it. Sire? 147, yeah. Man, I should be quite set up then, and then I can push some greed. Because Cavalier is so good. He's not going to suck too much on level 5, even though it's a, it's bad level for him because of armor. But because he gets that cleave. And we've got archers behind it that really help on level 4 and 5. They didn't do a sun 2, so I should be absolutely guaranteed. I'm feeling like this could be the one. Cavs and cannons. I've always disliked the cannons in the sense that they cost money. So if I build them, I build them right towards the end. I wasn't blowing money. Send what you can, boys. There we go. Boom! That is so sweet to have a Cavalier. Mm. It's like getting a Hydra on level 5 or something. It just feels like you're nice and secure now. Cavalier is going to carry for quite a few levels at least. And then obviously I'll try to get more of them. I should try to get two of them for like level 7. So at least as long as i got one of them, it should be easy enough to get the second one now. 30% chance. See, the gold I get at the end of this, plus any... Potential extra kills. I could put down another Cavalier. I bid you. Knight. And then start pushing. Or push a little bit. Get an upgraded Archer. So I can do well on level 4 and 5. Yeah, maybe just push and then get the upgraded Archers. Or more Archers and upgraded Archers. Ah. I see. You guys like my Archers down there, do you? God damn, those spirits are a bit annoying, aren't they? Come on, boy. I was expecting to do a little bit better, to be honest with you. They have been wailing away on him, though. I think the double spirit is quite nasty DPS, to be honest. I was expecting him to do a little better there, so I'm going to have to cancel that. I've only got 2 nil. I think it didn't help that they snuck onto my archers. Just when I was getting happy about things. 
I get screwed. I had 500 value as well. Yeah, it's magic damage. Well, they wouldn't cheat, would they? I'll have to do a tree of travel now. It's just going to kind of mess things up a bit. It will help him get into combat quicker, though. Actually, if you get one near the front, it will slow them down. That'll be fine. That can work, too. I'm a bit annoyed because I could be having a more greedy game now, but it is, it is odd to send a double spirit, I will admit, but a little sus. Are they that desperate to win? They wouldn't cheat, would they? See, this level looks super easy now in comparison. I am prepared. Mass Tree of Travel is a good strat. I've <laughs> never heard of Mass Tree of Travel. If you, if you only plan on getting past level 7, maybe, but I can't imagine it carries on very well into the game. See, at the end of this level, we can put down another knight, and then at the end of the next level, we can 100% get another cavalier, and then it kind of works out again. And this time, I'll have the Tree of Time to stop them from reaching my archers, especially with two knights as well, to sort of block. Because that's what happened, is these got reached too easily. I didn't account for that properly. Hmm... Dark Mega's got a scuffed build over here. It's going to fall apart later on. you got a Lord of Death already. And a 4-1. How's he getting away with it? That's how he's getting away with it. He's only got 550 value. He could actually potentially leak next level. I don't know. Fortified armor. Tanking. He might be okay. I'm going to build to get kills on level 7, because I think two players, are, these two at the bottom, are definitely going to leak on level 7. So, whilst I could push for some greed, theoretically I'll get just as much greed if I just actually kill their leaks. Speaking of which, give me the money. Give me the cash. Give me the cash. Yeah. Give me the cash. It's only 50 to 60%, but you've only leaked once. Seems a bit of a steep um, depreciation. Does anyone like this video on YouTube? Have you liked this video yet? Is any gonna, anyone going to watch me level up in Season of Discovery on February the 8th? Cavalier. Yeah, Stormgate opens up to everyone on the open beta for that. I still think we've got a while to wait for Stormgate. <laughs> They're not showing custom games yet. They barely get like the melee games out the the you know, out the way. The game is nowhere near ready. That's going to take a while, Stormgate. Trust me, that one. Unless you're Unless you're competitively trying to cover the melee aspect of that game, there's no reason really to worry about it.
absolutely annihilated that level. Got revenge. What am I sending? The blood orc? Oh, no. I can't quite do it. it. Depends if they take a bit longer. Are they going to force my hand? They're going to force my hand, aren't they? Wait, no. Furbolg and Hermit? No. It did it again. It cucked me. You cucked me. That's what the satyrs say. Okay, no excuses, no leaks. They'll probably send mass spirits again or something. Your first stuff was when you played. It was under my old username, Moist Casual. You're a Moist Critical fan, are you? I've got the least greedy push so far on my team, but I'm hoping to make some money here to make up for it. Mm. Furball, Kermit, okay. I really should decimate this level, especially with that slow. It makes it so these guys can't quickly surround you and annihilate you. So I really shouldn't have a problem. If this guy survives, that'd be so good. Please survive, he's not going to survive, is he? Got the Furball then. Bagger. Unfortunately, the damage distribution wasn't quite correct there. If he survived, I would have had two of them. But to be fair, not many people have leaked anyway, so... You actually did better than I thought you was going to do. So I'm not going to get to steal that many kills. And I'm going to have to compete against Soap. 80 to 90% there. Why are you getting 0%? The fuck is... This? Oh, there you go. 70 to 80%. I am seeing some plus fives and plus sixes there, though. That is nice. Oh, it's a plus twelve. See, we're making some money back now. That's how we do. Oh, you stole that one. 180. It's time to mass archers, I think. And screw over level 10. And then if anyone leaks on level 10, then I'm going to take that as well. Your move. My bidding. Upgrade complete. Do we only need the one Malile? Or do we get multiples? I can't remember what their, you know, their, their upgrade value is. Like 115 gold or just build more rangers. They get like 2.7 times the damage, 2.7 times the health, 40, 40, 40. So it kind of seems like you may as well just upgrade. But people do tend to go mass archers. Yeah, I've seen them do that. But the problem with mass archers is it takes up that food supply as well, doesn't it? I wouldn't mind another cavalry, honestly, just because I feel like the damage distribution is too high on one of those cavaliers. I am prepared. He keeps getting his ass absolutely whooped whilst the other cavalier is like very comfortable. If I get a third cavalier, this one won't lose so much bloody health. Enlighten. Can I get away with that, plus the income, plus the kills on these? I reckon maybe. I'm lining up the Wisp. Nah, I'm trying to. I'm trying not to do the Yeeks this time. Get a bit of different, uh, get some Cavaliers in there. There we go, see? So we can get Cavalier. A third one will definitely secure the deal. No excuses. And then whatever Arches I can do after that. That way I won't feel like I'm spamming too many archers. If the sell rate was higher, you could definitely play more for what the level is. So I could like happily put down a ton of archers knowing that I've, I get like 80% or 75% gold back. But because you only get 50%, it doesn't... You have to sort of play for the long game. Not just to do well on one level. Summers are hot here and very sweaty. Oh, I see. Lovely.
terrific as a maniac. Easy level. It's so nice seeing a move at one mile an hour. Frost slow is always so OP. You sending a spider, are you? I can send a spider. I reckon I can get it in time. I don't know, actually. Time is ticking. Ooh, are you going to cut me off on the spider as well? Like you cut me off before. Oh, there we go. It's a fur bulk spider. My bidding. It has begun. Okay. We can get two archers. That's not too bad. I can settle with that. Looks good to me. Done. Put you one in the head, actually. You don't need to be that far behind. I got a lot of Cavaliers set up. It's almost like a re-roll or something, maybe, to see... Although you do say cannons. Cannons are good. Good good pumping DPSs behind. I don't have quite the income to cover them so easily. Send trash. Yeah, go on then. Ready to work. Ready to work. Right, let's see how we do. 18.30 Fally. Get in there, boys. This guy is taking ages to get around, so I like that. Might be able to kill two of these. If we can keep going. Are you going to stop DP? No, you didn't. Good. You're starting to swap damage onto the right guy, which I don't like. Even though you had a clear kill on this left one, so unfortunately, AI did what AI does, which is derp out. It could have easily killed that. We had so much value and still leaked. I really don't like level 10. I feel like it's so fucking RNG. It's like annoying RNG. It's not even like fun RNG. It's just like, oh, you got fucked again. Brilliant. Why not just make five of them with less health? It's just so dumb having three of them and then one of them just sort of they your your units just like stop attacking it for no fucking reason. And then they focus oh this one that's got fifteen hundred health instead. Three thousand health instead. Let's go for him. So bloody annoying. We're going to have, like, no lice at the end of this shit. I don't know if we can kill it, boys. Is it a bloody another game? There's already been so many already. Can't get past level 10. Yep, we actually can't do this. That's just fucked, man. Games definitely are ending on level 7 and 10. It's almost like the... The map maker needs to actually fucking change the power scale of level 7 and 10. Just make level 7 spawn like 5 less satyr. And make level 10 fucking spawn 5 of the mobs. But divide their health so it's all still the same amount. It works out as the same amount. But that way you don't get so fucking screwed by only killing one of them. Whereas if you have 5 of them you're more likely to kill 2 or 3. Which is going to be better for you than just killing only one. Yeah, man, this is painful. Dun, 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 dun. Hmm, that is scuffed. We got Disciple, though. We can go real gambly. Gambly, boy. I mean, the, all the games beforehand have been super gambly in a way. They all ended quickly, so I can go really greedy, and then we can still die in level 7 or 10. Disciple is like, just freaking push like a madman, isn't it? I, am prepared. I will level up Mage and Paladin in Season of Discovery. 
Just not sure which one gets priority. Mostly mage. Just playing Warcraft 3. But dropping a new poem. New sick beat. Next Thursday. You guys got to check out the Grinchy. Click on his little name in the chat. I'll take you to his channel. He uh, streams the Warcraft 3. Does he look? Does tournaments from now to uh, now and then, and uh, likes to entertain his chat with poems too. Woots, thank you very much. Hello, catching me live. Caught you caught me. Red-handed. Doesn't the mermaids work well with the Messiah? You're probably right. It probably does. But it's like 130 gold, isn't it, for a mermaid? You get 119 gold here. There's no way I can get anything. Can the disciple solo... You could get an egg sack. I could get one more wisp. Or you get the advanced lumberjack. That's really greedy. Getting a lot. I don't know if I have enough gold for that. You do that... Egg sack next turn. You should... Disciple should be OP enough with the egg sack to cover. And then the mermaid, ideally. On top of that. We will see, though. I don't know if I'm going to have enough gold for that. But that would be a really good early game. How far ahead do I want to put it? That will do. My brothers. So you've been following this on YouTube. Ah, oh, you're spoiling yourself for the next YouTube video. But that's fine. Come on over to twitch.tv slash witty. No more Warcraft Rumble. At the moment, no. I don't even like I like I like the game for what it is, but it's got its problems in the sense that it's a mobile game. That's the main problem, right? If it was just an actual normal game, it'd be great. So, I'm still just... I don't really have much spare time at the moment. It just either goes on Season of Discovery, doing something random on that, or working on videos, editing, stuff like that. Man, Disciple, doing some work there. They're all lined up on that egg sack. It actually works really well with that. I've definitely got enough gold for mermaids, so yeah. This could work. We could potentially get two Frost Armors. One for the egg sack, and then one for... Either the mermaid or the disciple. That will help. So this is looking quite cute. Out with it. So 130 gold. I am prepared. There's that filthy footman again. I won't do this behind. I'll do this next turn. To sort of make it harder for them to snipe the disciple. He's got 550 range, 500 range, so that should put them basically side to side. Strange sound, isn't it? I'm feeling cute. They sent quite a lot. A lot of weird stuff. I got stunned by the orc on my disciple, which is really bad. At least he got the frost armor, but I don't know if it's going to keep him going long enough. He needs one more shot. And he gets it. That'll do. It doesn't look great, but trust me, that wasn't ideal. They sent quite heavy. We got a big leak on our side. I don't know why we always seem to leak so much. They're abusing spirit. They sent so much shit, didn't they? It was really unlucky that the warrior got the stun. We're not going to have much to get the kills, either. At your call. I think we're just going to have to end the game on level 7, right? Let's just up the king damage at this point. YouTube streaming when? Oh yeah, no, they do allow it. I just haven't bothered to set it up. Just 
What I don't like about this is they get some of the gold, don't they? As a reward for their send, so the rich get richer kind of thing. Yeah, I don't know if the game's already over, is it? Because we all leaked. It seems like kind of rough, doesn't it? Sixty gold. What can I do to save the day? Sea giant is the only hope later on. Hey, Can't even upgrade that. Yeah, we'll just upgrade the sky dragon, maybe. I am prepared. Upgrade complete. I'm a bit worried about this level, to be honest. Oh, I watched that um, Raccoon City, uh, Resident Evil, the one from 2021, a couple of days ago. I kind of enjoyed it for how shit it was, if you know what I mean. <laughs> the casting was awful, though. None of the characters were who they should be. Like, Wesker wasn't Wesker, Jill wasn't Jill, all of that. Chris was probably the closest one to Chris, I would say, by a long shot. Claire wasn't really. She was like the master of lockpicking in this, even though that's supposed to be, um, what's her face? That's supposed to be Jill. But yeah, Whisker was like silly and goofy for like 80% of the movie. That's like completely not his character at all. It was kind of like caricaturish. That's why I think I kind of enjoyed it, is it felt a little slapstick. You know what I mean? It felt like they were having a bit of fun, but it was obviously not good, because it was like, this is a serious production, right, isn't it? This is like actual movie, there's money in this, right? But if you was to like, take it from the point of view of just watching it, because you know it's daft. Wesker dirty. Wesker was just a dumbass, in it. It took you five times to watch it to the end. Oof. At this rate, I'm wondering if it's just my spirits. I want to do a sea giant. I really want to do a sea giant, but I won't be able to afford it. I think I've got to re-roll. Or I can do a footman and guard for level 7. That I could do. 280 gold. You're not going to have like this. It's a weird amount of gold I've got left over. If I sold the sky dragon, I could do a sea giant. But I wouldn't be able to do the, the Hydra after that. Shit. I'm not sure, boys. It, oh, man, this is kind of rough. It could just be double footmen, honestly. Guards. Not that I really want that. Hmm. I'll stick with that for now. Leon. Oh, Leon was terrible in that movie. Yeah, he was nothing like his character either. He's just a good-looking guy. That was basically it. But there's nothing like his character. He's, he's smart, he's calculated, he's funny from time to time, Leon. He's very grounded, quite serious. But in this, he was just dumb. I haven't seen the Aquaman 2 yet. I'll wait until there's a better version of it on the Pirate Seas, and then I'll, I'll check it out. Tactical League. 
Actually might be a tactical move. Oh my god, that's like the slowest to kill level 6 ever. I stand. 376 gar. I think to do well on level 7, you need to get guards. As much as they suck, I think you have to do it. See, I could do two, two of them, right? 160 gold, so 200. 80... I don't know, actually. I don't know if I can. No, it's 160 gold. I need to sell the Sky Dragon to get a second one, so that doesn't work. You can get one guard, 200 gold, but then 200 gold on what? I've got a reroll, but I really want the Sea Giant. I'm fucked, boys. I'm rerolling. And I found a Knight, so I'll get a Cavalier later, but it's not ideal, is it? You'll just have to do for now. This has been the most scuffed game so far, at least in sense of what has been available for me to build and stuff, I think. I was doing well on level 7, until... Twenty nine to their forty so we made them leak more at least. And we got immolation, so we got no trouble on the king. So at least that's a bit of a comeback. But if they got a bigger push, then it doesn't make too much of a difference. They're up in the king. We don't need to upgrade the king at all, so Yeah, I think they abuse income and stuff like that, don't they? On up in the king. They haven't got immolation either. Don't think we should lose a life. I might have to do some damage action. I don't want to lose a life. I think just need a bit to make sure he doesn't lose. This will suck if we lose one life, boys. Up him or something. Fuck. That's lame. And then they don't lose the life there. Oh god, this game's a shit. I haven't seen Arcane 2. I'll get to it whenever I get to it. Oh god. Thank you, Light. I'll take your money. This game's gone to shit, though. This is not a game I want to be in. Gonna die again on level ten, aren't we? Direct me. My brothers. No one shall be the wiser. Job's done. You might have anti ten, I suppose, yeah. I bid you. I'll just push and be greedy then. No chance. I can't depend on trying to do well on level 10. It's never going to happen. I think level 9 is going to be quite tricky. Unless I get the Cavalier. Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to have the farm to worry about as well, aren't I? Ooh, actually leaked. I suppose that's a good thing with 7 2. I'm just worried about what they've got. I should just put the first game onto YouTube, the one where it finishes at level 7, and just say that's it. Two hundred forty-four gold. Do I even bother? 
I kind of need to, because level 9 will destroy me. Out with it. But I'm still going to do bad level 10. How can I, help? I might just still kill one on level 10, though. I don't know. I'm always like thinking, oh, maybe I can get one. Is it worth upgrading Blood Orc Warlock to give him more of a chance? It's a 120 gold investment, and if you don't even get one, then you don't even get 51 gold for it. I am prepared. Like, Flamebeard's going to kick in at some point. I'm going to 100% put that bad boy down. And then just Cavaliers around it. I don't really... I mean, my roles have been bad in all these games, isn't they, really? Apart from the water mentals, I don't think I actually had any good roles. I always seem to be, like, lacking some good damage dude at the back or something. All kind of trash. Never do a spider again, probably. And then lots of trash. Three hundred thirty-three gold. No, you're not going to kill level ten. Best you can do, you do one hundred and twenty, two hundred and ten. You can do two upgrade, mm, two hundred and ten. I'd have to get a couple of kills on the mobs, and then one hundred and twenty gold for the next upgrade after that. Best I'm giving you is the Blood Orc Warlock. Level 10 doesn't deserve it. The only problem is we probably just die anyway, because I didn't build enough to defend first as level 10, but... I feel like you've got to take the gamble. The game's been going on too bloody long. I mean, they've got good anti-level 10, so they say, so that should cover us. There you go, that's 120 gold. Yeah, I was never going to kill one anyway. So it doesn't matter shit. That was the right call. They've actually had a big leak on their side, which actually gives us a much better chance. Got to get greedy, boys. Get your greed on. Because they'll probably have a fair bit of income because they've upgraded their king a lot. So I wonder if we should start upgrading our king as well. We've already gotten to leak more than us, so... That's already a win, getting them to leak a lot more. Well, I say a lot more, it's four versus our three, but... They won't be able to stop this, whereas these guys can get kills. So I think, look at that, you guys get those kills. That really, that's the one time Wolverines really pay off there. <laughs> Those really paid off. They're anti-10. Oh my god. They really went for it. Yeah, I think we push a bit of income here. We've got a big win here. I should have actually sent a dino thinking about it. Won't have enough lumber for it. I can almost send one. But not quite. I could still send it, to be honest. There we go. That's okay. Just make sure it goes through. 200 gold. I might even put down a nut. See, they've got 7-2 across the board. Oh, yeah, we got good. 7-4, 7-2, 7-2, 7-3. Their values... Oh, I don't know. We got pretty even. They got more of an average income around 60. We've got 72 here, but then 42's there. So a bit lower. I feel like if we can win this... I don't think Knight's particularly good, but I'll put it down just to have a chance of surviving Job's done. a little bit longer. Hmm. I don't know, though. Wolverines. I think their units are probably going to be a lot better for fighting than ours. Unless Wolverines get props. I think we're probably not going to win here. 
the sire and mermaids and the cavaliers. Yeah, we can try it. It'd be cool if we won this, but I don't think so. I think their army's much better for PvP. Although we've got a Hydra. We had a Hydra. We're pushing, but the archers are just whacking away now. Yeah, they're going to take this. That's a shame. They got more of a push now there. So they all got 200 plus on that one. Out with it. It has begun. For my brothers, no one shall be the wiser. What do they have? I don't like it, but I think that's what we have to do. Go on, that king. If we race 16, I don't think we win, necessarily. It'll be very close, but I don't think so. We, I mean, that's not going to do well, 16. So, yeah, I think we have to go for 17. Would I prefer that we can do it? Yes, of course I would. But we can't. We have to take the. You know, you're on the. You're, you're not got. Beggars can't be choosers. And you have to basically play it. Setting up the big boy. Enlighten me. Job's done. That's a given for my brothers. I mean, you'll have to move out of those Wolverines now. Try to get some. He's going still too into them. <laughs> I can't possibly do well into like level 14, 15 plus, can they? I am prepared. Can't see them doing anything. One should be wise. Job done. He's got the gold at least, but he needs to start spending that gold into something that isn't those. One of these two. So it can make up for the fact that they're going to suck later on. I think you're going to have to stay at 7-4 of that, I'm going to say. As much as I like my greed. I don't know. I think 7-5 is fine. Maybe you can just do it now. Get it done and then stop at 7-5. They got a bit of a leak here, actually, which is good. Or is it? We'll see. Yeah, they got so much range, man. You can't go 16 against that. Enlighten me. 312. 13. Should I dry the Dark Messiah now? Give him a whirl. How can I, I help? Upgrades complete. Yes, my lord. You require my assistance? I don't know if he really has any impact on the Cavalier. Because I know some abilities, like their mana-based abilities, are fixed anyway. You can't, even with mana regen, you won't actually make it happen quicker. 
but I don't remember which ones those are. This looks like a rough level, even if they don't send. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think this Messiah was a good idea, necessarily, but... Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Now I'm worried. 16 is going to be... Ugh. I just don't like these rolls. I guess I just have to mass mermaids. It's not great. It's not great. It's not like I'm massing something I feel good about. It's just it's just the best of what I can do. Unless I want to re-roll again for 15 gold. 50 gold might be worth spending, to be honest. Out with it. It's probably worth spending the 50 gold, so. Your honor. For now, I'll just spend my money on this. Oh. Yes, build more farms. Build more farms. Build more farms. Build more farms. Research complete. On this. Thy bidding. Now I'll do for now. That'll be a couple of frost armors being chucked out all over the place. Got a couple of those. Got some explodey boys. Yes, I don't know if you really need to upgrade the fire overlord as long as you've got the fire tiles where they need to be. I am prepared. Especially for how much he costs, 380 gold. It really depends. I, I've never been able to do the math properly on him, nor would I ever bother to do the math. Sorin, thank you very much there for the sub. Remember, level 16 I'm worried about. They might still go to 17, for all I know, but... Oof. I'm not quite able to manage it, guys. Are they supposed to explode my units? Because it doesn't feel like they're exploding. Hmm. Thank you there for the sub. Do they explode? I am prepared. Seems kind of lame. Well, only the first mob explodes. That can't be right. I think this is a reroll for sure. You really like upgraded flame beard. You, you're not shitting me. You're not trolling me here. Enlighten me. Research complete. There's a necromancer, so that's something at least. And then some wyverns for 16, potentially. Wouldn't mind ghosts, but if we get that done... I don't know, let's do a ghost. That's not going to be enough money spent, though, is it? How much money am I going to have left over for this? 130 gold. All I can do is another necromancer. I just hope they don't send. I assume they won't send this level. If they do, then I'm fucked. <laughs> What do you think then? Wyverns, I guess, for 16. I don't know about phantoms. I never quite know those. People seem to like them and say they're good, but if I get wyverns and rangers, you've got the focus fire piercing damage. Although the phantoms can do well on 17, I assume. This is one where the Twitch chat can backseat game. I think they might still go 17. No, actually, this, I don't know. At least we got the ghost. I am prepared. I guess we are. 
I beat him. Necro's the only good roll. Mm, that doesn't fill me with confidence. Let's try the double. I know the phantom is supposed to be good if they're upgraded. So let's try one phantom and upgrade it. And then that will cover me for 17. If they don't go 16. Job's done. There you go. I spent literally all my money, so. Upgrade complete. They're saving it for 17 then, okay. All I can do is mass phantoms then. We can't send 17. No, I guess, well, I guess even if we do send 17, so I guess we can't. But yeah, I don't know, it's a tough one, isn't it? It's like we have to, but you can't. You haven't even got as much. No, you can't, literally, you can't even send a demon, so. I think we're just in a shit situation, boys. You just have to, I bid you for my just have to wait. Do I have anything? Should I re-roll again? It's gonna cost me a hundred gold. I think you just gotta do mass phantoms and hope for the best. Honestly, I think I just blame it on my rolls this time, honestly. Build more it has begun. I think I just gotta do mass phantoms and just Research complete. It has begun. This is a shame. This is the one game that went really long. And it's the game where I feel like my units are pretty meh. But having said that, my units were pretty meh in most of the other games as well. But they weren't as bad as this. I had like cannons in the previous one and stuff like that. I could fall back on. Oh fuck, no chance. That's it. GG. I got double demon and a kraken. Zero fucking chance against that. One of you has to survive. To be fair, they did pretty well on the right-hand side. We're not going to kill freaking... Oh, well. That was a long road to get to this point. Ah. That sucks. Too many meme builds. I'm not re anymore, no. Way too much to fight there. Yeah, that was pretty shit, man. Team stream snipe, more like. Definitely cheaters on the other side. Let me know what you think in the comments section. I reckon they were cheating. They went against sending on 16 there when we started like upgrading and talking about it. I reckon there's definitely some cheats going on on that side. One of them can't help but fucking watch the stream and snipe it. Pieces of shit. Oh well. Feels bad. Bad ending. 